Thank, thank you, thank you, Susan. Um, it is a, such a great pleasure to be here celebrating 100 years of public policy at the University of Michigan. And it's great to see so many personal friends out there, fellow alums, uh, students, sports school faculty, staff. It's, it's this network of fabulous people that keeps me coming back to the school and keeps me engaged in the school. And I, I just thank you all for being friends and colleagues. The principal mission of the alumni board on which I serve is to engage the alumni population in the life of the school and to support the students who are here in their career development and their career opportunities. Turnout at this event was one of the projects for this year, and I think you can see by the 400 strong here that um, a lot of people contributed to making this event a success. Um, I know our current alumni board did a lot to help. Uh, alumni board people, raise your hand. Thank you. Former alumni board members, former alumni board members, alums that served on the volunteer committee for this event that called their fellow alums. Thank you all for, for supporting this. Um, my next duty and honor, and the reason I'm really up here now with the microphone, is to present the Neil Stabler Distinguished Service Award. The Stabler Award was established in 1987 to honor Neil Stabler, who was one of Michigan's leading political activists. His life was devoted to improving democratic government in, by increasing participation of citizens in all aspects of public affairs. Neil's son, Michael, has stayed here a few more minutes before he goes out trick-or-treating. Um, so I want to recognize Michael. He's, Michael is on the Ford School Committee and has been a terrific friend of the school. And, and is another one of those people I count as my friends in this network. The Distinguished Service Award recognizes a Ford School alum for outstanding professional achievement. The recipient will have demonstrated a commitment to addressing public policy challenges of the world. And through his, profession, his or her professional accomplishments and public service. The, the 2014 winner is Patrick Anderson. <laughs> Pat, Pat is the principal and chief executive officer of the Anderson Economic Group. The Anderson Economic Group is a consulting powerhouse. It has provided services to numerous states, private firms, countries, and universities, including UM. Before founding the Anderson Economic Group, he's, Pat served as Deputy uh, Budget Director for the State of Michigan and Chief of Staff to the Michigan Department of State. He's been a prodigious writer with over 100 articles written on, and articles in other publications on policy issues. He just recently released The Economics of Business Valuation, published by the Stanford Press. Um, the National Association of Business Economics has given him an award for outstanding writing for three separate works. And Pat has continued to give back to the Ford School. He has hired graduates of the program and served in a leading role in raising the money for, from alums for this building. We thank you for that, Pat. In the end, though, the committee selected Pat from all the many other distinguished alums who were nominated because he has been using his analytical skills and his public policy degree to change policy. He has made a difference and he continues to make a difference. His leadership and analysis have led to numerous changes in state law around personal, prop personal property taxes, state sales tax, um, increasing wages for home health workers, um, the creation of a Michigan earned income tax credit, and many, many other things that he lists in his bio. Pat has moved the dial, and we can expect it'll continue to be a policy powerhouse going forward. Please join me in congratulating Patrick Anderson as this year's recipient. Thank you. 